Now, let us have some fun. So, right now, we're going to have some Starfield time because Starfield is a lot of fun. Now, afterwards, we will be talking about some of what happened with Milltown. Or, we can start off with the drama. Actually, I'll uh, set up like a little poll here. So, here we go. Start with drama or Starfield. I feel like I should have started that poll when the stream started, but... Well, it is what it is now. It is what it is now. Because, of course, I've now put the poll in chat. We have whether or not we're going to start off with drama. Or if we are going to start off with... Uh, get the drama out of the way. True. That's true, but... Ah, uh, fine. So far, two votes for the drama shit. God damn it. Ah, uh, fine. Milltown is awful. Super Dave slash Milltown's best. There we go. I got that kind of out of the way there. Now we are going to kind of look into something here. Now boop, and then uh, boop. There we go. So Milltown, what the fuck? Jesus Christ. So Milltown has been Pretty fucking shitty, by the way. So, again, he has his shitty little video planned where he wants to try and be, like, this content creator or some shit. Now, knowing uh, Milltown, he's going to obviously hide it behind the whole Super Dave account. As you can see here. He's not aiming to make any real content, nothing real, nothing really worth it, because uh, he's wanting to continuously be a moron. And again, we go to Milltown's best. That's where he is. That's his content. Now, of course, he has all of this. Unlisted, as usual. All of his content has been unlisted because he is afraid of real repercussions, actual accountability, because he's a genuine scumbag. Now, his plan, by the way, is to make everything on a new channel. These are the type of people that will flood YouTube, Twitch, TikTok, Twitter, whatever with hundreds of new accounts as soon as they get any form of criticism. And I do believe Milltown should be deplatformed. Do I believe he deserves a platform? No, I don't. I really fucking don't. This guy's a scumbag. He is a genuine scumbag. Because you see all of the literal fucking lies that he spews out. He just harasses people. He's a genuine scumbag. And, of course, people are going to say, Oh, Slug, Slug, you're, you're being too mean. You're being too mean to Super Dave. Now, Dave is someone that will openly be like, Do we think D-Max got raped as a child? facts just learned that myself but uh if if date or if fucking milltown wants to cry about this shit whenever anyone goes after him he wants to act like he's a victim really 
Really, Dave? You're a victim? Dude, you're just some fucking loser. You are a genuine fucking loser. Like, you have done nothing but continuously lose your fucking mind over everyone critiquing you. He should have. He should have. He can't handle being the bad guy. Because knowing him, being the bad guy is going to genuinely drive him up a wall. It'll make him lose his fucking mind. Because he wants to be the, oh, I'm going to take down Jeremy Hales. I'm going to take down everyone. Really? Like, that's what's going to be fucking there? Like, at, at the end of it all, it's just pathetic. Like, actually pathetic. So, you continuously see this. He wants to play victim, too. Same way as he will say D-Max got raped as a child, which I've said very edgy things. I've been a dick to people. Is kind of like, well... Like... There we go. <sighs> like, it's really fucking annoying. It's just fucking annoying. So... Milltown needs to, he asks for critique from his own guests, but then he acts like he's able to handle it by going so much further. Like, he wants to consistently harass people. Just like how, remember everyone, Milltown wanted to harass my family too. Just so everyone notices. He wanted to contact my family, harass them, go after them. And that's how Milltown operates. Oper he's operating just like Hugin. And Hugin has been on this whole we need to defend Milltown type of shit because he's just mad at everyone. Yeah, flamenco type shit. And Milltown freaks out because then as soon as someone come just comes at him he'll be like slugs suicide suicide baited his mother really like milltown is an autistic fucking loser that has done nothing with his life except ruin his family's credit fucking hell and he wants to act like he's some fucking content creator ha <laughs> Jack fucking shit is what he is. He's not a content creator. He's not entertaining. And he will never be entertaining. He's done nothing but fail and flounder. Now, why why did I start off this segment saying he should be deplatformed? Because he does not add anything. It is like people who spam out AI-generated slop. There's no creativity. There's no personality. He is a genuine malicious individual. He has done nothing with his life except harass people and go after them for made up reasons. He is a schizophrenic conspiracy theorist. Like, it's fucking insane. Yeah, he's nothing but someone. With a hand up their ass. Just like, hi, I'm, I'm Milltown. I'm saying what Salvo's saying. All the while, his asshole's getting stretched out. Just like, hi, I'm Milltown. I can't think for myself. I'm a little pussy. I'm a little pussy ass bitch. Because that's how Milltown is. And peep the tattoo. Ooh, woo. Chat roboting at every ch chat rebooting at everything. Shut up. <laughs> but it's it is what it is at this point. Like at the end of it all, are you really going to be surprised that Milltown ends up losing his platform? He'll end up like Salvo 
hopping from YouTube channel to channel to channel to channel. That's just how he is. And his content's no better. Like, look at this. Bad intro. His whole audio waveform bit is old and over fucking done. His takes are fucking bad. Everything's fucking bad. That's not even talking about how he wants to do this whole transparent ghost shit. This is lazy. This is lazy fucking work. Because he's just using a green screen filter over himself to the point where he looks like he's in 480p. The maximum fucking quality he can upload is in 720p. Like, you really want to act like you're a qualified content creator when you can't even upload above 720p? Really? You can't make anything over 720p? Really? Really? At the at this point, just use StreamYard. Just use StreamYard. You're uploading in the worst fucking quality ever, and then you end up confused why no one watches you. No one is going to load up a shit tier video in 720p in the year 2023. But that's not even touching again on his associations. Now, who does Milltown associate with? Hugin. Hugin is one of those people that's genuinely fucking malicious. A guy who has been confirmed to have beaten his wife half to death. This is not an opinion. This is a genuine fact. Because Hugin is a domestic abuser. He is a doxer. He is a genuine malicious force in this fucking community. And he's been an abuser also while he was doing meth. And you want to know what's interesting? Little uh, Milltown would hang out with Dove of all people. You know, the fucking doxer. Little uh, schizophrenic doxer Dove. Because there's been a lot of wild and wacky things that Milltown would do. He just continuously tries to be this little guy. That, yeah, this isn't even touching on little valid opinions. The fucking dumb cunt that's a okay with doxing and shit. And the more malicious shit. Milltown and Hugin. Also fucking associated with how Salvo runs. The guy is a psycho. So yeah, no, Milltown. Fall out with his co-host. He falls out. He's like the fat dude version of Ember Lily. Like, what do you fucking mean? Like, we could easily just be like, Ember Lily. Oh, wow. She has stayed offline because she's psychotic. Good. Be gone, whore. <sighs> it's genuinely fucking annoying when I see people being like, oh, Milltown deserves to have his platform. Fuck that. Fuck that. Milltown has never showed change, never shown growth, never even tried to improve as a person. Out of everyone, I'd rather Salvo stay around instead of Milltown and Hugin. Salvo has redeeming qualities, like he's entertaining. That's it. Milltown, Hugin, Ember Lily, Dove, Valid Opinions, all of them are just fucking the worst parts of Salvo personified. Parking Tigers fucking moved on, did his own content, did his own shit. But Milltown, Hugin, Ember... All of those fucking degenerate scumbags wound up just being pussies about everything. They're just scared of the reality that they are not creators. They are not people worth watching. They should stay in the chat and not behind a camera. Wow. Isn't that, isn't that interesting? Some people should not be creators. 
I know, controversial take. Some people got it. You go from chatter to creator. For example, Leia. Leia, you're able to say whatever you want about her, but at least she goes out of her way to actually plan out her shit, plan out the content. Like, look at that. Entire shit that is just fucking easy to say. Look at that. She plans out her shit, all of that. She plans this shit out. She doesn't have all of this shit just consistently fuck up. Then you see people like fucking Milltown, where you see the laziest fucking content. This is a template-based shit. Lazy fucking audio. Everything's garbage. That's just fucking trash. So no, I... I genuinely fucking think Milltown should be deplatformed, dude. I genuinely think this. I think Milltown should not have a platform. Salvo deserves a platform more than Milltown. Because Salvo, hate him all you want. He actually makes content. I hate Salvo's content, but he makes content. He's a scummy fucking person. Scum of the fucking earth. Genuine fucking awful human. But he makes content. Miltown acts like a victim every fucking time he's critiqued. Oh my god. <gasps> Leo said I'm stupid. Leo said I'm retarded. You are. You're pathetic. You're a loser. You're bad at everything. Salvo's a piece of shit. Salvo's a terrible fucking human being. Like, genuinely an awful human being, but he knows content. Hugin, awful human being, bad at content. Milltown, awful human being, bad at content. Salvo, awful human being good at content not good at trolling good at content that's what he does you pull this up look at that you see this look at that you see he knows content he would get views he would do shit He's a fucking asshole. He's a piece of shit. But he has the redemption of being entertaining. But you see this shit. You see this shit. And it slowly is just like, yep, that's fucking Salvo. Milltown doesn't do shit. All of his content is bad to the point where he has to obsess over fucking Jeremy Hales. This guy should not have a platform. I'm fucking snuffing out Milltown before he fucking has a chance. Because this guy will not add anything. His takes are fucking bad, mid, not even insightful. There's no creative or transformative idea with it. It's like, I'm gonna be a contrarian. I am going to continuously harass this individual. I am going to say, I believe your mother should be raped. It is I, Milltown's best. Daymax was raped as a child. That's, that's what Milltown will do. There's, it's the same thing Hugin does. Two people... They will make up whatever they want until something sticks. And all of this shit is pathetic. I don't think he deserves his platform. And I genuinely fucking believe that Jeremy Hale should have fucking obliterated Milltown off the platform. I, sh I hope that Milltown gets fucking destroyed by Jeremy Hales. I hope that 
Meltdown loses everything, dude. 